<laughs> okay, so now we're hooked up. All right. And this is the most aggressive curve. Most aggressive curve with 10,000 RPMs. But that don't mean the engine's going to do 10,000. The carburetor probably wouldn't support it doesn't. 10,000. Uh, well, hopefully you never would hit it. Okay, again, folks, it's... seeing how that I smashed all the park spark plugs shut, went for a ride, it did pretty well. Now I've got them set at about 30. I might play with the carburetors before I go for a ride because it'll probably actually dial in now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> on, a, on a stock one, that's what you do. Well, Was it? It was great. <clears throat> the Hooch project is 100%. I'm sure there's some fine tuning to go on, but whatever it is, I've never been able to experience such a fine level of tuning, fine level of running, and I've got a lot of time into twisting knobs and making things right, this, that, and the other. I think it's going to hold. I think the margin is big. Um, I just got finished uh, pulling up aggressive hill. At, I started at this time. I started out at 1500 RPM. Run on up the hill in fifth gear. Not near a spit, sputter, clanky, and everything. Nothing. It doesn't seem like the wasted spark is affecting this thing in any way, shape, or form at the moment. You know, this is all, I've only went around the big block, but. At the moment, I couldn't force it to spit. I tried, <laughs> you know. <laughs> I couldn't force it to do anything except run good. That's where it is. Um, you know, I took it up to about 100 in that little short stretch that goes from one road to the other road. You know what I'm talking about, Dan. Yeah. You know, I went up there, took a left, and the very next road to come down. No trouble. I don't know enough about the bike to actually hang in there and do anything like that. You know, cause I haven't got any miles. I'm not comfortable yet with the tires. Don't even have any miles on them. This, that, and the other. I felt a little bit of something right here. So I'm not really, you know, aggressively doing anything. I just went up yeah. there to see it. Was your highest RPM that you did on that ride? Mm, Roughly. I didn't get it up to. Uh, I didn't even get it to the red line. <laughs> I guess if I got a little more stupider, I could have. <laughs> but I was, you know, <laughs> I had to stop, slow down to get to the road. Yeah. Plain and simple. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. As soon as I got up there, it was time to go back down to make the turn. You know? It's right there, huh? Yeah. It's fast. You get the this wheel is, uh, you know, like if I if I was doing a project, I, I don't know about the C5 and all that, but you know, when I get a project to this point, you know, uh, it's really, you know, what else more I do to it would probably going to hurt the thing, you know. <coughs> plus, pl you know, past playing the song right, you know, you you're in another land up there, <laughs> you know, and that's uh, this this thing, this tune is playing well. Nothing to change. Cool. Really. As I see it right now, I just went around the big block. 
but that's my impression. Now I haven't even played with any any advanced curves. To well, it's in the most aggressive mode, you know. I know but, the carbs ain't dialed in because the reason why the carbs ain't dialed in is because I smashed the plugs flat. And, uh, you know, man, this thing ain't adjusting like it did yesterday. Your your max advance is uh, what, 38. Do you want to try it at uh, 40 or 42? Well, not right now. I really, you know, you know what we got right here is like uh, if there's a like a some more edge to go. You know, like you were yeah. saying, you want to drag it to put it on a dyno and stuff like that. You know, that's the land we're in. Well, you know, why not? Why not go ahead and have him have him change change one curve to forty two and see. Let's see what it what does. Like, and if see what it while he's still does. here, what it. Oh, okay. Well, I mean, I'm all, I'm all for that. I'm just saying that's not like uh, like, you know, I'm, you know, I'm expecting. It's, it's almost it's almost like it doesn't even need it now. Huh? No, I mean, it's already <laughs> got more than I can actually deal with as far as like uh, being sane. <laughs> yeah, or, or take it on a track. Could y'all hear it when I went up the, the hill the first yeah. time? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, coming up this hill here, it's, uh, it's amazing how smooth it is. I never mm -hmm. took it off idle. I mean, maybe I was a little bit. You know, there's a little play there. I mean, I was still resting at idle, yeah. basically. That's Heavy a pretty good idle, grade. we call it. Yeah. You know? Nice. And uh, this is the only bike that'll come up here and do that. This is not a gold wing anymore. <laughs> a couple gold wing riders, you know, like that. It's not a gold wing anymore. Yeah, it is. It's got all the torque that. Uh, well, now it's on. now it's now it's what uh, Honda should have made it. I guess <laughs> it's just like a, a, anybody that's rode a wing for a long time ride this and think that they're on a different bike. Plain and simple. Awesome. <laughs>